Otherwise, there's also a singing story that she has. and welcome to another video with Lempis. It's morning time, that's why I still have my satin bonnet on. I'm, of course, at home, it's Friday morning. I didn't go to work today, also the past few days, because I've been really sick. I went to a conference three days ago, or, yeah, and then I came back a day, like after the following day. I went to a conference on a Tuesday and then on a Wednesday I woke up really sick and I had to come back home. Since then I've been at home wearing the mask all the time around my family members, so Olivia, Ale and our au pair. <coughs> it's, it's, a, it's a very difficult time at the moment, especially for a working mom, because if you go out and you get sick, even if you're not just working, you go to a shopping center whatsoever and you get sick, when you come back home, you have a baby, obviously you won't be safe. And the best way, I feel the best way is always just to have the mask on all the time around the house until I feel better. And then when I eat, I eat before, after my uh, after my family members, and then I ventilate the room before they enter. Every other time I really have the mask on, except when I'm sharing and I'm the one last one to shower in the evening and then leave the bathroom also open just for ventilation. I don't know how much that helped, but you know, I'm a mother, I'm trying to do everything possible to protect my family members. Um, I'm going to get Olivia ready for the day so we can start the day, then mama can, I can go and do my COVID test to see how we're doing. I'm feeling way better. Last night I was able to sleep the first time in like three days. So I'm hoping that everything is fine. I'm hoping the test is going to be the test is going to be negative, and then we can maybe have a relaxed weekend. The camera is not focusing on my face because it's impossible to differentiate from the mask. Excuse me for that, <coughs> but I just cannot remove the mask now until I do maybe the COVID test, and because I'm all in the room with Olivia. Oh, this was really cute when I first got it, but now I'm not able to use it anymore because every time Olivia is in there, she just put it out, I think, in, in a week or two, I'll just remove it because it might fall on her face. <coughs> Firstly, because of how I'm feeling, I will just start by really disinfecting my phone because I was using it all night. And then my hands. Yeah, it's, it's a challenging thing because I use my, I disinfect my hands a lot when I'm really sick. Uh, but because the disinfectant that I'm using has a lot of alcohol, 70%, 75% alcohol, I also need uh, to wipe myself afterward, maybe with water or baby wipes, so I do, because I just think it's too strong if I touch my baby with this stuff. It is really, it is so bad when you're sick and you're still breastfeeding. I'm still like exclusively breastfeeding. Of course, I'm pumping, but what I'm trying to communicate here is that Olivia is still not taking a formula. I want to start. I want to start. But yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a little bit harder than I thought. So I'm still like uh, giving her full time milk. So, oh. <laughs> so, um,. Because of that, ibuprofen, I can only take paracetamol, and then I took a cough syrup, which is also suitable for the baby. The rest of the cough syrup, if it doesn't have a, oh, what is it called? I don't know the English term. What is the English term for? Like, if it's not authorized to, if it's not approved for babies, then I should not be taking it because maybe it's not suitable. The end products and traces end up in the milk. Mm, mm, mm. No, 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 Olivia, no, no. No, no, we're not taking mama's mask. Huh? Oh. Hmm? Oh. Mm. This is the new thing now. Look, look at mama so I can moisturize your face. Oh. Oh, my and then I put you in a hat. Then you are ready to go and play with the cat. If the cat comes by today. <laughs> This is my favorite, favorite hat for Olivia. Look, look, they look really cute. Okay, we're ready. We're ready for this. 
Oh, we don't have a phone to take a selfie for Oma. A selfie for Oma. Okay, let's go play. Let's go play. So when she's here, I always have this here. It's a pillow because she likes to kick and keep her legs up. And then she has the newborn playful thing that makes a lot of noise that she really likes. Otherwise, there's also a singing story that she has, but I don't use it now because I'm filming. And this is, I love to do this in the morning because she's quite active. So as soon as she wake up, I put her here, she can just play, she's looking forward to that, and then I'll feed her an hour later. Okay, that's gone. Will it be? Good morning, cereals. Hmm? Oh, you love? So happy. Here yeah, after this, you're going to get a tea, like a normal breakfast, a tea, a tea. So I have from this packet here that I got from my employer, I got like a, a, the buffer. I have the swab to take, like the cotton thing to take the sample from my nose. And then I have the antigen test here. So I'll just go ahead and do this as fast as possible. I would say as a working mom now, it's very difficult to go to work. If you're not going to work, maybe I'll just suggest you stay at home. And when I was not going to work, I was just staying at home. But um, when I'm going to work, it's especially in November here, it's the time that you have also a lot of just people getting sick. And at the moment, the COVID-19 um, COVID wave is already increasing. Although people are uh, vaccinated, like I have a, a friend who is fully vaccinated and has been sick for the past two 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 week um, two weeks with COVID. So I'll go and do this. Oh, oh, I opened the wrong way, but I'm not touch it. I'll just squeeze it from here. I'll go a little bit off of camera to do this because it's next. Ah, oh, it's. I'm sorry. I'm crying. This is so bad. Oh, Put this in the bathroom and I'll let it stand here for a while. I would, when I'm here, I actually don't want to touch a whole lot of things apart from what I'm doing. So you have your sample mixed with the buffer. I'll dig for a wishy. I'll put this here until the thing's full enough to, to go through the test. In the meantime, disinfected. I have been, when I'm sick, I have disinfected. Like I have the disinfectant in every room in the bedroom, it's important. I disinfect my phone most of the time, my keys as well, everything I touch. Not only for Olivia, also for everybody living in our house. Just, I feel like um, for me, from my microbiology background, um, kind of, I'm able to keep the mask on all the time when I'm sick. And I'm always feel like, or maybe just a motherhood uh, thing, I feel like I have to do everything possible to protect my family. And I feel like I don't want anybody getting sick in the family because I don't think they are going to want to have the mask on 24-7 around us and around the baby. So I'm trying to do everything possible to make sure nobody is sick in the house. My hands are like trash at the moment because I've been using disinfectant every few minutes. Also when I touch spoons and fork, although I eat different times for my family members, I just want to make sure everything I touch when Ali is coming to touch it, maybe he might touch it and then touch her nose, trees, mouth. I just want to make sure that's clean because everything you're taking is most likely to go through the some particles and end products end up in the 
Oh, come here for a moment, and particles. Hey, Papa needs to start working. Oh, Papa, 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 we have good results here. Good you know? results. Mm -hmm. Ooh, here, I just did Why my are test. So small in there? I don't know. <laughs> and it's negative. It's negative. Yes, so, so you just have cough. Yes, I feel and really, really, really good because now I'm not feeling so that sick anymore. And this is the last test I'm taking. I think I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> Your person doesn't say that though. <laughs> okay guys, I unfortunately need to start working. No. It's a Friday. It's a Friday. It's a Friday. My goodness, when you use my cream, you're using so much of it, it's going to run out and then you do not spread it very well on your face. You just have like white stuff. You need to mask it to absorb, absorb it. It's, so uh, uh, it's a mask now, it's and not it, even and cream. It's like one centimeter thick cream all over my face. <laughs> like I buy my most precious face cream. And Al is using it, and when no, he no, is no, using sorry, it, I need to correct. More precious cream is not. It's, it's like neutrogen cream uh, oh, for it's every day. Nine euro. A nine euro, baby. Uh -huh. I was using like a ninety-nine cent cream when I was a student. So uh -huh. nine euro is already a thing. This is the third test I took since I started getting sick, and it's negative. I'm very happy, and today I'm feeling way better. My nose are not really running, and I have my voice back. It was terrible two days ago. I could barely speak. So I'm just happy and I think it's going to be fine and I'm worried mom is fine. But although the test is negative, I just feel safe. I'll keep the mask on maybe today and tomorrow for baby Olivia and then uh, after two days I'll go back to not wearing the mask. I'm also not sneezing anymore, which is a good sign. Olivia, let mama clean up this. Oh, Olivia, not to worry. Yeah. To buy your best friend, so to bonus deal. When the after the walk time. Yeah. Oh, now Olivia is sleeping through the night. Yeah. Yes. Are you serious? Yes. 